Yeah, Christian, uh, could you walk us through those two at bats you had there late in the game, the, the the two run single and your home run, what you were looking for and what you got? Yeah, so um, coming up my third at bat against uh, what was the pitcher's name? Marceau. Marceau, yeah. Yeah, Marceau. Uh, I mean, he was doing a great job, of, uh, you know, keeping our, our lineup down, mixing well, have that off speed working. Um, my first at bat, he had thrown me a couple off speed, one fastball. The next at bat, uh, more fastballs, I think. So, you know, uh, in that situation with runners in scoring position, I knew that he was going to probably try to throw some off speed, not just throw me a straight fastball, maybe get me, you know, outside of uh, my zone. So I was just really looking for something up. Um, and then with two strikes, I mean, he, he was in the zone majority of the game, I feel like to me. So um, I knew that he was going to be in the zone and he, he hung a curveball and I was able to hit it for a single. Um, and then the, uh, the last at bat, um, there was, I, I don't remember exactly where the runners were on base, but, uh, the pitcher, I think, uh, there's, there's some balls, maybe got a, a inside strike for a fastball that I thought maybe might've been a little in, uh, I'm not really sure. Um, and so then it was three, one, and he just threw a fastball up in the zone and I just tried to take a good swing on it. And then what? What do y'all think? I mean, Kevin Copps has been on an incredible roll lately. What What do y'all think whenever he comes in the game? What's it like playing behind him? Oh, it's so nice. I mean, <laughs> I, I'm waiting for the time that someone hits the ball out to me because, I mean, no one has since he's been pitching this season. So I'll be surprised whenever someone hits one off of him. But, like, it's just nice to know when he's coming in that he's going to get the job done um, in any situation. I mean, I, I was saying it all fall that he was the one person that I that I hated to face. I mean, he, he's made such good strides, and I'm so happy for him, all the success that's coming his way. Randy? Christian, talk about the play that you made on the throw to third to nail the runner. Were you anticipating that particular play because uh, you came charging in? You didn't hesitate at all. Was that kind of going through your mind, I'm going to be aggressive to get the runner? Yeah, for sure. I mean, that situation late in the game, they're trying to get something going. Um, I mean, that was a good ball for them to try to attempt to go uh, first and third on. I mean, it's not a, an easy throw. A lot of the times it, it can't get away. Uh, I mean, throw has to be perfect. So I'm just keeping my eye on the runner. I, I saw that he was, you know, running hard uh, around the second, and I just tried to, you know, uh, make a good throw uh, to third base. That's an instinctive play in, in my mind as well. Uh, when you run approach, were you looking for a specific pitch or was you just uh, kind of setting on the fastball and whatever happened, happened? Um, sorry, I didn't hear the beginning of the question. Were you talking about the uh, the home the run or the home run? The home run. Uh, I mean, three one. Um, I think you may have thrown like tried to throw one off speed for a ball. Um, it was out of the zone. And so three one, I was just expecting fastball, uh, just trying to get a good pitch to hit and not try to do too much. Just take a good swing on it. And uh, it, it got it out of the park. Dead red. Sir. Coach, anything else? Yeah. Christian, y'all have really been really good this year on getting opponents, uh, opposing pitchers' pitch counts up. And, I mean, the guy tonight had a no-hitter through six, but was up close near 80. Well, what's been the key to that? Like, getting the, even if you're not getting anything against them, how are y'all able to get his pitch counts up? Um, you know, I think it's just having good ABs, you know, not going down easily. Uh, you know, that's something that Coach Thompson has instilled in us. And I think we do a really good job of, you know, not giving away any at-bats no matter what. Um, you know, even if you aren't uh, ending that bat in a hit, you can do your job by running up that pitch count so that we can get that guy out of the game and then, you know, hit those relievers. So uh, we did a good job of that tonight, and uh, we'll continue to do that in the future. Randy, you have anything else? I'm good. Right. Thank you, Oliver. Appreciate your time, Chris. Thank you, Christian. Thanks.